What is up, my friends? This is the very beginning uh, of a new journey here. I got my guitar in hand. I got Shooter with me. Shooter. But unfortunately, Shooter's not going to make a trip. But we are Nashville bound. We're leaving literally right now. Zach Stamey, Focus Media, video documenting the whole thing. We're excited about it. Super stoked. Cut some awesome songs. Soundstage. Nashville. Music Row. Get ready. Here we come. Tennessee, my brothers and sisters. Tennessee, we're there. We all line up single file to the concrete jungle interstate parking lot. Like so it's only fair that we would run into some rain. And ironic, nonetheless, because the song that's playing in the background is the song that I'm cutting. Carson Chamberlain, a big producer, writer. Uh, wrote this song. Let's see if you can hear it. It's called Here Comes the Rain. It's pouring down rain. Seven hours into the trip. It's a good song. We're cutting it. It's raining. Here comes the rain, Nashville. Here comes the rain. The gas on the flame. Without sunshine, till I finally found. Hey, this has been a long day, dudes. Uh, nine hours almost on the road. Uh, we are in Nashville, so that's very exciting. Day number one, uh, heading to my buddy, uh, my buddies, let's say that, uh, from uh, South Carolina. They're from Sumter, South Carolina, Lee and Lewis Bryce. You might know them, maybe you've heard of them. Uh, both of them doing the thing in music right now. Uh, me and Zach are uh, crashing with them tonight, and then studio it is from Friday, Saturday, and Saturday on. So uh, excited uh, about the trip. Got a lot of fun things going on the next three days. Going to be a lot of work, but uh, really excited about it. So uh, stay tuned, my friends. We'll be back. What is up, y'all? Uh, the morning of number two, day number two, that is, uh, here at my buddy Lee Bryce and Lewis Bryce's house. Last night was epic. Hung out with Toby Keith. Great night. Big things to happen today. Go to the studio. So we will uh, keep you posted, my friends. Always in it, and I could wiggle out of trouble in a Carolina minute. Us boys were never afraid to bring it, to bring it on. And daddy raised me on a Bible and a hammer and a gun, and I got my first buck when I was 10 years young. At 13, my whole life was changed by guitar and a song, and I knew someday I would be gone. I carry it with me It's part of my history Where I'm coming from in my blood, in my bones Every shovel of dirt was a small stepping stone My roots will never let me get too far from home Cause I carry it with me Huh. 
was a picture of how to live a life He made damn sure what he did was always done right And that pride and passion was passed on to me I guess I'm just one more big old limb off a strong family tree And I'll always be Suitcase back, no words were said Diamond reeling on the bed Four years hanging on a thread That she said You know that it's not you, it's me There's a world I've gotta see Our last kiss landed on my cheek She picked a plane right over a plain little life Needed neon lights, not a Carolina sky She left these old dirt roads where we fell in love Off a little teacups, not the sweet iced tea Life over love as she followed a dream And she didn't even roll the dice She picked Paris over paradise A paragraph on a piece of paper Held by a magnet on the refrigerator Said it all You can't change the mind of an 18-year-old Cloud of dust coming from a Gran Torino Taking off Population one less restless soul Run away to below Gone, make yourself a memory I'm Nick Autry, I'm, uh, I'm with Black River Entertainment here in Nashville, and uh, I found this young man named Ricky Young playing in a bar, and knew I had to work with him. We finally got him down here into the studio that actually run here on Music Row called Soundstage. It's been here for longer than any of us here in the room have been alive. Um, over 500 number one hits cut here on the floor, and we just cut, um, we just cut Ricky's record the last two days right here. Um, and I'm pretty honored to be a part of it. I've been a part of some really cool projects in the past year. I've worked with uh, Buddy Guy, Steve Cropper, David Lee Murphy. Um, and, you know, he really trusted me to, to do what I think is best. And, you know, I think it's going to be one of the best things I've ever worked on. Nick Autry has been a great, great producer. He has teamed me up with a lot of uh, unbelievably talented musicians. And it's been a lot of fun. My name is Michael Spriggs. I'm a session player here in Nashville, and we're working for Ricky Young today, and Ricky is very, very cool. I've had a, a great time today. Uh, he's a great singer and interesting background. Uh, we've had, uh, and we've cut eight sides in about seven hours, and we've literally kicked ass. He's been singing all day, and he's just rocking his butt off. Um, there's a song here that I love. It's called I Could Be Going Home. This is the chart for I Could Be Going Home. I love this song. When you hear the record, listen to this tune because you're going to really dig the message. might even make you cry. Hey, this is Tom Hambridge, and I'm a uh, drummer, session drummer, producer, songwriter, and uh, spent today playing drums on uh, Ricky Young's album, and uh, he sounded great. Uh, great vocals. Um, Really a cool artist, um, and I and a great songwriter too. I uh, one of the songs uh, we cut, which was one of my favorites, was uh, the last one we did, Paris on Paris over Paradise. I thought it was great. We might even be listening to it right now. I'll try to turn this down. <laughs> That's my uh, headphone monitor. Um, and Runaway Tupelo was a cool song. I mean, I, I just I just overall dug the whole vibe today. Hey guys, Pat Buchanan. Coming to you from Soundstage Studio, where we just finished working on the Ricky Young record today, and it was a pretty awesome experience. All the songs are really good. I think my favorite might be the Runaway Tupelo thing, because we got to play some harp on it. But uh, there's some really good songs on it. Had a great band today, and 
just a great experience. Hey, what's up, y'all? Ten months of working on this project, spinning my wheels. We are finally done. We are finally completed. Uh, we spent eight days recording it, endless days mixing it, and finally had it mastered. And very excited for you to finally hear it. So uh, please check out Spinning My Wheels, and we will see you on the road, my friends. Instead of this whiskey bin, light and green, how you been? I